Hi guys, I wish to show you how to, to use the tabs or to create tabs in Microsoft Access Forms. Therefore, for instance, I want to come up with uh, several forms in one form. Therefore, I need to use a tab tool. For instance, I just create a form in design. Like now, this is my form. You can just have it uh, with some color that way. Then I just save this form of mine as 2021. That is the form name. Then up here, if you are very keen, there is this button here. This button is called the tab control. And uh, I can use it to create tabs to enable me switch from one form to the other without really you are struggling. Therefore, what I need to do is to click on the tab button and then I can just draw it here. Therefore, this is the tab. You can see I have page one and page two. I can even have several pages. Then I just go to property sheet here and I, when I click on all, when I am in page one, I can be in a position to see the name of the page. Therefore, I can change this one to accounts. Therefore, this is the accounts. I want it to have accounts and also accounts. If you can see here, I have changed the name uh, of that tab. Then this one is page two. This one I can just call it sales. Sales. Sales that way. Then I can even now add more pages. I can insert another page, page three, by right clicking. Therefore, this one, I can just have, uh, have it as products, products that way. Therefore, up here, if now I save this and run, you'll be in a position to see that um, I have the, uh, tabs, I have different tabs created up here. And therefore, I can still now assign even more features inside these tabs. If I can just increase this, the size of the tab that way. Then we start with accounts. When I'm in accounts, I want to bring the accounts form here therefore you can just drag and drop the form you can remove this here if i can just uh, take this one there that is the accounts then i go to sales i go to sales and take the sales form here I just go to sales entry here i bring the sales there therefore this is the sales then i can just remove the the caption there then i go to products I also go to products and then go to products form here products form this one I bring the products form there I remove the tab there then after doing that I can now save this one and run therefore there we are we've been in a position to see that um, up here I have the accounts I have the sales I have the products you see now I can be in a position to switch between my stuff easily without actually struggling and therefore that's how you create tabs that is in microsoft access forms thank you very much for watching see you in my next session